Hello friends, welcome to another C++ interview question and the question is what is auto keyword in C++ and so the answer is it is used for type detection okay so what is this type detection thing we'll just see that here so if you notice here I'm keeping auto 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 three time and this is 20 this is 20.5 and this is base this code will really work so we'll just see that first so that you can just be sure about that so as you saw it is compiling and it is running so here what is happening this is nothing but replaced with integer here so if I'm writing auto instead of writing integer when it is compiling that compiler is generating integer code here here it is double and here it is if it is base then the base will come here and if I'm writing it something like this like new or something then this will become base pointer okay so if you see here this is for four base and if you notice it is not exactly telling you the type here I am giving you the output type like uh, this is one another method of getting the type of your object or your variable I have explained this concept in my previous video if you have some doubt you can just go and check that so this type ID will get the type of this X and we are just printing the name of that so in, the, in this case it is printing I I stands for integer D stands for double and this four base is nothing but our base only so they are changing the name but throughout whole application the name will be same so that you can be assured of okay so right now I'm working on Linux if you will go for Windows then the name might change but that name also will be there throughout whole application same so if I'm getting the this base type anywhere in this whole program like I have thousands of functions and if I will get the type then I will always get the base like four base only and if it is pointer then let's see what it is giving you the output in that case so we'll compile this now and we'll check that so if you will notice here it is appending P here if you notice here it is P four base and before it was four base so as you can just think of like P stands for pointer okay so this is how this auto work if you have defined auto it will deduce the type automatically okay so this is new in C++ before in legacy C++ it was a simple auto okay but now in C++ 11 we are not using in in that simple way this it has some different meaning and it is really very powerful when it comes to genetic programming okay and this mechanism is called resource acquisition is initialization how this is understanding that I should keep this as integer not float or double or something else it depends on what you are initializing this 20 is of integer type and this 20.5 is of double type and this new base so what is this type this is something like you are creating a pointer of this base okay so this has to be a pointer so this is how this compiler interprets and reduce the, I mean deduce the type of that so we're done here. Thanks for watching and make sure you go and check out my other playlist so that you will get the questions like this. Bye bye.